Clinical research and diagnostics frequently make use of fluorescence-based amino assays due to their high sensitivity and ease of operation. However, the autofluorescence of capture surfaces, such as magnetic beads, produce strong background noise. In small, Dr. Amos Danieli from Bar Ilan University, Israel, and co-workers devise a novel photobleaching method to reduce the autofluorescence of magnetic beads, improving the analytical performance of fluorescence-based immunoassays. The system we use to photobleach the beads includes a laser that is reshaped by two planoconvex lenses, is reflected by the chroic beam splitter, and focused by an objective lens onto the sample of magnetic beads. Two electromagnets aggregate the magnetic beads to one side of the kivet. The laser excites the magnetic beads and the emitted autofluorescence is detected by a photomultiply tube and displayed by an oscilloscope. The autofluorescence properties and the stability of the photobleaching were analyzed over a period of two months, indicating that the photobleached beads were stable over time and their surface functionality was retained. A commercially available immunoassay, human interleukin-8, was detected with a threefold improvement in the detection limit and signal-to-noise ratio of immunoassays compared to non-bleach beads, and autofluorescence was reduced to 1% of the initial value. To find out more about this photobleaching method to reduce the autofluorescence of magnetic beads, please visit the small homepage.